This module covers international and supranational law that relates to environmental issues. That body of law includes classical public international law, but also other forms of global and transnational legal ordering that applies to environmental problems. That framing of both classic public international but also global law is important because we have lots of public international law that relates to environmental issues and that's important for states to work together in relation to environmental problems which are often transboundary. But there are also lots of other forms of global ordering that relate to environmental issues. For example, companies may find it important to have common environmental standards to trade internationally. What exactly we do varies from year to year depending on the members of the faculty who are around to teach on the module. Generally, we split the course into two halves. In the first half, we look at overarching ideas and theory. And in the second half, we look at a series of case studies. So for example, this year, we began by looking at the development of international environmental law. We looked at the sources of international environmental law. We went on to talk about state liability, state responsibility. Eloise did a class on transnational, global, international law, how those three things might be different. And then the case studies really varied. I did a class on space law. Eloise did two classes, one on access to justice, one on principles. Philippe Sands did something on international courts. Now, year to year, the content will change, but that kind of split between overarching theory, ideas, frameworks, and then the case studies will remain. Now, in terms of the classes themselves, what we do is we give you a whole series of readings to do in advance, and then the seminars are discussion-based. So we'll ask you questions about the reading. And I think we've both really enjoyed this year, the level of debate. So students really getting into the thickness of the ideas and the issues and challenging us on our points of view. The only final thing left to say is about the exam. Two-hour exam, unseen, you get to choose a couple of questions to answer.